In this video, we're going to talk about tags and categories when you're creating discussions inside the SOLIDWORKS forums. One thing I also wanted to mention is right on the home page, there's a forum, forum tips area, and that actually lists all the different forum, different topics we've got, about how to use the forums more effectively. So we're going to talk about when you're creating a discussion. So I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to create a question about installing. So I'm just going to write my question completely. Installing eDrawings 2014. So when I ask a question. Uh, again, the behavior is a little bit different in every area. I can go ahead and look for similar content. I can search all the results, or I can just go ahead and ask the question. Depending on where you are, it may ask you what type of question you want to ask and sp specify the area. So, a couple of things uh, when you're actually creating a discussion, and you can mark it as a question, or if it's not a question, you can unmark it, uh, but create a good title. So, installing eDrawings. Uh, you know, maybe I would type, you know, how do I install, maybe the title could be a little bit better. Try to make your title so people can read it and understand it. And I can type in blah, blah, blah. All right, so I make sure that you have a nice discussion about, or description about what your problem is and what kind of question you're having. And you're going to see two, a couple areas at the bottom here, tags. So why use these? They do help categorize the content, make it easier for people to find. So if people are looking for your question, you want people to answer your question, comment on it, make it easier for them to find it. If there's a category that applies, go ahead and select that. And if I start typing in uh, an item, you can see e-drawings, e uh, You know, There definitely is sometimes some cleanup. Again, anyone can enter anything you want. But you can also see when I start typing here, it comes up with you know things that might be applicable what you're looking for. So go ahead and type things that you know collect things that are actually relevant, and you'll see they'll appear here. If you want to get rid of one of them, you can just go ahead and get rid of one. You can add multiple ones. Once you're done, all you have to do at that point is just say post, and it'll post it with that tag and those categories set. And this will help make your questions more discoverable uh, for other people that are trying to find it. Thank you very much.